we will now examine a review playbook, one that includes many tasks as it will be in the official exam. This review playbook contains two plays. The first one is the enable internet services and the second one is test internet web server and some tasks inside the plays. Let's now see what tasks are included. The first task is the installation of Apache package HTTPD and also the package of Firewall D. So this task ensures that you have the latest version of these packages installed. And we can see from this syntax that we have included the installation as a list. The second task is to copy the welcome to the example intranet, this file in the destination, which will be the default Apache folder, the, this one. So we copy this content into the index.html file. The next task is the one that includes the service module. This module allows us to enable, start, disable a particular service. So for this particular task, we, we use the service module and check the state of the firewall D package. So we instruct the operating system to enable and also start the firewall D. And we also have the same task, but for Apache package this time. So we use the service module with the Apache package. These particular tasks use a firewall D specific module, which instructs the firewall to allow a particular service. For, for example, we allow the HTTP service port 80, and we instruct the change to be immediate and also permanent so that we have this state on reboots. This is a very SOS topic as it usually comes in the exams. The, in the end of this playbook, we have a separate play which will execute the task on localhost in comparison with the first play which executes on some client machines and this play will go and make a call on one machine to verify the content and the status code of 200. We must verify that we have included the become keyword on this particular play because most of these tasks want pseudo privileges in order to run. So we will go now and execute this playbook using the ask become pass directive on the command line because we the, the password must be passed for the particular user that I, I, I run the playbook for the user student. So we can see that the tasks started to run and some of them are already in place. That's why we get a green result as for example, HTTP and firewall D were installed on this machine. And as you can see, all the tasks completed except on the last one, which performs the curl command and we get a name or service not known because I have an error on the on the FQDN. As you can see, the the machine is called Sendos Box and not Sendos Lab. I will go and edit this entry here and I will name it Sendos Box and I will rerun the playbook. Normally we should have the same results, but we must have also 
the successful result of the last play. We wait for the task to be completed and we will see also that the, the last task is also successful and we get a 200 result as the page was copied.